How's it going? Uh, my name's Tommy. I work for uh, 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 nobody because I'm a farmer and uh, I've got to do a bit of a service on my tractor today. You know, my tractor is a good old John Deere, you know. I, I had a lot of masses, but the uh, the old John Deere is a lot better now it is. It's a lot better. But uh, in this one today now, I'm going to be uh, uh, going to be changing the oil in, uh, me, in me John Deere, hey. And uh, I'm going to have a look at, uh, you know, the spark, the spark uh, plugs. I'm going to have a look at them and see if they are right then. And then I'm going to put some power into it. I'm going to put a new Blitz air filter into it, a flat panel one, yeah. And it's going to get lots of power. And like, you know, and it's a VTEC as it is. It's going to be really, really fast. This is now after this air filter. And uh, 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 yeah, so just watch the video and see if you like it, no, you know. what's happening uh um today i'm just going to do a service on the honda stream i'm going to be putting in uh, um uh, this lots of power no no there's not going to be much power out of this maybe three or four horsepower but uh, the car has about 138 as standard um so the car will now have about 140 ish um, i'm not going to be doing the spark plugs because they're iridium spark plugs uh they last a long time and i have them in a year or so now um, I have checked them already. They're all perfect. Uh, so yeah, I won't be doing the spark plugs, but I will be doing power upgrades, and uh, I'll be also doing the Mugen oil filter. Um, that's all. Just it's a simple video for anybody that doesn't know how to do a service. This is not a step by step, but I mean you could just look at it if you wanted to and see, you know, see how it's done. I'm not going to tell you. Step one, take the top cap off. Step two, and release the drain bolt, whatever. I'm not going to do that. But you can see the steps that I've done right I'm taking the top cap off, taking the bottom, whatever, you know. Just watch the fucking video, will you? That's it. It's a quick little service because it needs it. So that's what I'm doing. Enjoy. <laughs>
Tommy here again. Uh, I'm just going on a little drive. I've had a shower, I've changed my t-shirt, and I'm just going on a little drive to see how the uh, how the how the blitz panel works and see is it any 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 use, you know what I mean? So uh, I'll go one, two, three, let's go. Hulk up! Oh Jesus Christ, that took fucking ages, but dear god that was fast! Whoa! Okay, I'm going to have to take that back out. That's too fast now. Oh, I'd be bleeding plowing the neighbours' fields and all with that thing. Fucking hell! So that's the end of the video. Uh, I just want to say that when I put the Blitz uh, air filter in, I got a little bit extra, like, grunt. Like, it sounds a little bit better. And, um, like, maybe a couple of horsepower more. It's a little bit more acceleration. But, uh, other than that, it's exactly the same. I didn't put the air filter in for power. I put it in to let the engine breathe a little bit easier. Because standard um, fucking paper air filters are very restrictive. And uh, it's like running a marathon like this. You can't really run and breathe properly. Um, where with this one, it's like trying to run a marathon like this. It's a little bit easier to breathe. Uh, so anyway, uh, thanks for watching the video.